It's painful to make this video. Franco Harris passed away like two days ago, and now we've lost another player, and he was extremely younger. So the first tweet we got out of the situation, or if I, uh, for me, was the um, from the NFL. We are deeply saddened to hear about the loss of Super Bowl champion running back Ronnie Hillman. He was 31 years old. If you don't know who Ronnie Hillman was, Ronnie Hillman was the running back for the Denver Broncos, selected in the third round, 67th pick of the NFL draft. He spent four seasons with Denver. Neil Hillman was on their Super Bowl roster. He was on the Super Bowl roster at the time. In 2016, he split games with the Vikings and Chargers, and he spent his last season with the training camp for the Dallas Cowboys. And you want to know why he passed away? In August of 2022, he was diagnosed with renal bullary carcoma, which is um, a kidney cancer. That's actually, if that fails, you have to start on dialysis. But they were unsuccessful and earlier this month he had to go to hospice care so this is like the end of care line end of life care so the goal is to not make him live longer but to make him comfortable as possible and he also had pneumonia which is like the inflammatory condition of the lungs and it also could provide death like have hard breathing dry cough and chest pain and a fever and he passed away on my Wednesday and he was only 31 years old man we're losing too many people this year at such a young age like on April 9th we lost Wayne Haskins at just 24 years old after he tried to cross the um, freeway then Jeff Gladney passed away at just 25 years old after a car crash and then most recently um, no, no, no. T six months ago, on June 21st, Jalen Ferguson, at just 26 years old, dead. And the cause of his death was the combined um, effects of fentanyl and cocaine. So, drugs. So, we need to stop this. I hope I don't have to make another video of this again this year. I hope you guys enjoyed a Merry Christmas, and I'll probably see you for week 17 predictions, or if we have another breaking news or something. But you'll see the video on the Dunkin' Channel on December 25th saying where I've been. I'm not going to give too many details on it. I'm just making you guys so you know what's going to be happening, okay? So check that out down below, or maybe. Goodbye.